I'm sorry. It's been a while. I still, I still look young. Despite the fact, wait, if my mouse is right, five years, seven months, 25 days. I didn't mean to budge and I respect it. But I had to come. There are some things on my on my mind I have to tell you. I get it. I get it if, after this, you want nothing to do with me. I get it. I get this part of the consequences, right? How do I even begin? I start from? You know, I now understand how much of an outdoor I was when I left home. I was selfish. I wanted freedom. I wanted to be free from your oppression. For this reason, I, I despised you. I wanted to run away from the driving force behind your hasty decisions. So when I saw the opportunity that night, I didn't think twice. I jumped into it. <laughs> that was the happiest night in my life. I was free. I had the opportunity to do everything I wanted. I partied. I smoked my lungs out. I, I laid every girl I put my eyes on. I was living the dream, ma. You still was living the dream. It was all, it was fun, it was, it was exciting. For the first of months, until all started to disappear. The system were in her favor. I was guilty onto proving innocent. I 
was in prison for four years. I was pity. I ate nasty food. <sighs> My cellmate was the gang leader, so you can imagine. I was just like a doormat to him. Soon, reality hits me in the head. Listen, I, I'm not telling you just to feel pity for me. It's my fault. Okay? Even after my return, I was... I was full of regret. That freedom I wanted. The freedom I dreamt of was snatched away from me. It was no longer mine. I was, I was in the hardest point. I was in the hardest point in my life. Times were hard for me. Ma, all I want to tell you is I'm sorry. And I want you to find a place in your heart to forgive me. I, I miss you.